Hello. Hello. Um, I want to say everybody, but I don't know, some people watching this might not have a body, so I'm going to say everyone. Hello, everyone. Oh, wait, what about um, two, three, four, five, six? Ah, uh, look, everything. Hello, everything. Welcome back to another pointless video on my pointless account. Um, and I hope you're doing well. It's, um, what is this one? It's Sunny R. Yes, Sunny R. And today, maybe it's not all too much of a pointless video because I have something very special indeed today. In all of its um, orangeness, I have Led Zeppelin's Super Deluxe Edition box set for none other than Houses of the Holy. And I'm sure, like me, you have delved into the dark depths of YouTube and discovered so-called unboxing, yeah, unboxing videos. When someone will just pick something up, like a, I don't know, CD, open it up, show everyone, and then chuck it back in the box. So, here we are. I didn't steal it. I don't want anyone in the comments section saying I stole it. I didn't, I didn't. But... I have it in my possession today, so I'm going to do one of these little unboxing videos. And as soon as you open it up, we see the amount of design that went into this thing. We've got, um, I don't want to touch it too much really, but we've got this um, orange uh, box, along with an orange little sheet here, and an orange book. So you, you get the theme? Yeah, I think you get the theme. Yeah, it's orange. There's nothing wrong with orange. Okay, so as soon as we open it up, we've got this um, this really nice looking book right here. So right here, we've got the outline of, of course, a Zeppelin. And inside, inside we can see the amazing album cover. Just open it up. A nice... Led Zeppelin logo and a picture. Then next, um, next we've got the album. I think these are notes. So yeah, those are the tracks, the track listing. We come into these pictures here, nice pictures. And I like the way at the bottom it tells you where all of these pictures are. So this is at um, Rolling Stones Mobile Recording Studio. At Stargroves, which I believe was Mick Jagger's house, if I'm not mistaken. So we've got some lovely pictures here. So most of these are rare. I've seen some of these before, but they're really nice. So whether they're rare or not, it's not really matter. Really. Right now. Here we have some tapes of the album. I'm guessing these are the uh, original tapes. We've got track one, The Overture, which turned into the song remains the same. Then we have the rain song, which is apparently the best one yet. Here's um, many, many times over the hills and far away. Crunch. Now on the other side here, we have side B of the album, which has tracks as shown. This is at a um, a uh, press conference in Tokyo, Japan, September the thirtieth, nineteen seventy-two. Before their short Japanese tour that they did, we've got some. I'm thinking these are posters, magazine artwork. I believe that's a ticket there, I can't really see. But very nice to have. Yeah, we get to the juicy stuff here. This is um, some really nice colour concert pictures from Japan that year they played. Here is this is a newspaper uh, cover. This is um, a UK tour ad on the other side. Now, we all know what this is. This is the grand artwork for the album. Turn the page again. We've got some outtake pictures from the picture sessions, the photo sessions that they did. Photo, yeah, photo sessions. This is very nice, I must admit. I know I'm joking around a bit, but this is very nice to have. We've got some magazines, 
Extra Bravo. Bravo, yes. And now this is one of my favourite pages because we've got some really nice pictures that I've never seen before. This is from Newcastle, late 1972. Same here, we've got Cardiff and Ali Pali from London. Uh, one of the last shows they played of the year. December the 22nd, I believe the second to last show of that year, yes. And here we have some tickets for Led Zeppelin in the Old Refectory, Southampton. Here. And then this is a nice little ad here, I'm guessing. Um, that's a that's in German, so I'm guessing we're on to the German tour, 1973 now. Tickets, some more live pictures. Okay, here we have some more German newspaper articles, and well, what do you know? In full colour, double page spread of the amazing, questionable but amazing album cover. The effect is shattering. I agree. I really do agree. This is a nice uh, something that I can't read, but I pretend I can read because it makes me feel better inside. And it looks really nice to look at, so I don't know why I'm going on about that. Here we have a, like a billboard from uh, the uh, LA Forum. Bonzo's birthday party in a Los Angeles billboard. Um, now, this there's, doesn't look anything legitimate about these these look like the fake singles that people used to put out got dancing days jamaica the crunch the ocean over the hills and far away live in paris uh the centre sportive if i'm not mistaken sports center here we have a really nice set of tour dates now this is their famous starship plane, private jet and a welcome back little tushy. Um, is this the next page? I really like this page, yeah. This is Atlanta on May the 4th, followed by Tampa, May the 5th. Well, I think this is the day, yeah, it broke the, yeah. Impossible, but they are bigger than the Beatles. Indeed they were. Bigger than the Beatles. Bigger than the Beatles. The bigger the better, I say. This is a nice page too. Now this I think has to be my favourite page. Well, my, one of my favourite pages. Uh, we have a nice image here. All colour images. I I really love this book. I've got, I've got to say I really love all of the colour images. Brilliant photos. Really good quality. The make is really good quality as well. How they made it. It's all very nicely done. I love the way I'm just talking about colour pictures and we turn to, like, the only set of black and white ones in the book. Well, not the only set. You know what I mean. Well, I hope you do. I hope you do. This is a really nice page here from Keza Stadium in 73. Ah, that's the Starship again. I think we're coming to the end of the book now. It's the Starship. That's the, uh, small man's are saying, from Madison Square Garden, July 29th. And then that's the end. Led Zeppelin robbed of all of that money. Not very nice people to rob them of all of their money. Well, there we have it. There you have it. That's the amazing book all right now we move on to a nice this is a print of the album i thought they were numbered but this one isn't numbered so i suppose this is number zero i think i'm going to take a thumbnail mm, cheese. now i would take this off I would show you the vinyl, but it's just too nice to have it on to show. And it's it's really hard to get back on. I'm sorry if you're very interested. It's 
got a nice little swan song sticker on the back. But yeah, this is the remastered album, obviously. And ha, huh, here we move on to the companion audio, Woo! which is really nice too. We've got nice vinyl in here. So th this is just, there's nothing on this, no barcode, no nothing. But it shows you the different rough mixes that they did. So I suppose this is like, I suppose this is the companion audio. You can't get it anywhere else, just for the box set only. Which is, I suppose, what makes it so special. Ah, here we have the CDs. We've got remastered album, of course. Mm. Then companion audio, once again, very nice. Really shiny CDs. I like the CD. It's very, it's really cute. I don't know why. It's just so cute. Right, let's put it back in. Come on, put it in, baby. Don't take that out of context. So then we all put it back exactly where we found it. And that, that, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, is Houses of the Holy. And I will see you in the next video. I'll see you. Bye. Love you. Mom.